All right, so Buddy asks, he says, yo, yo, you guys have anything that lubricates the joint slash muscle? Don't even know if there is such a thing that exists, but with this last batch of research chemicals that I got from another company, I <laughs> um, feel as if it dried up my joints. Okay, so first off, we need to make sure that we get our research chemicals from the most reliable source. Numero dos, the things that have been absolutely proven, and I mean like with double-blind control placebo studies proven, um, to be more effective than Celebrex at relieving joint pain with none of the negative side effects, I mean like, is MSM. MSM is actually supposed to be the fourth most abundant molecule in the human body. This is my bottle. Um, it, we don't have it anymore. We don't get it because it comes down in rainwater. It permeates all our fruits and vegetables. And, well, I don't know about you, but I don't get seven servings of raw fruits and vegetables a day. So when we don't have this organic sulfur, basically what we're looking at is you lack the ability to produce synovial fluid. When you can't produce synovial fluid, you get dried out joints. When you take an anabolic, it will increase cellular reproduction, actually dehydrating you. So what you want to do is you want to provide extra fluidity, water, along with the organic sulfur to increase elasticity in the tendons, increase fluidity and hydration in the muscle, and to lubricate the joints like a WD-40. This is going to be the best route, and honestly something that God intended to be in there in every meal that we eat. We just got so brilliant that, I don't know about you, but I don't get my fruits and vegetables fresh out of the garden and eat them within 12 hours of picking them. But the reason God made it the fourth most abundant molecule in the human body is because it does lubricate the joints, hydrate every cell in the body. It even puts elasticity back in the cells so that you get hydration and detoxification. You also can reduce water weight because you get truly hydrated. Even more than that, though, um, you may want to... If you have joint issues constantly, like you have the wearing away of the cartilage in between the bones, you got two bones there, you got cartilage in the middle, you wear that out, then what you need is ultra joint health. That gives the raw material necessary to rebuild at a cellular level, which means you could possibly rebuild a quarter inch of cartilage in as little as six months. I watched a 70 year old guy that was going to have double knee replacement surgery start taking the ultra joint health. And within six months, he did not have to have surgery. The doctor said he misdiagnosed, which I thought was funny. He was going to give a double knee replacement surgery to someone who didn't have knee problems. So he said he misdiagnosed whenever the guy told him he was taking ultra joint health because doctors say that nutrition stuff can't work. Nonetheless, if one was deficient of growth hormone, meaning you're above 35, then someone may want to ask their medical professional who's way smarter than we could ever be um, because you all must always consult with them before you do anything because they are like gods uh, about MK677 to stimulate production of growth hormone by the pituitary gland. What that will do is when the hormones are right, then they tell the body what to do with the raw materials, which is what those two products are. It's raw materials to rebuild. So the hormones telling the body to rebuild. Now you got a combination that just can't not work. But you can't get that for humans. You can only get that for research purposes on research facilities for research reasons. Newsarms.com can sell them to you for research, but you cannot take them. Uh, growth hormone directly, which I've been studying, as you can see up here, 
But growth hormone taken directly is going to cost about a thousand dollars a month, whereas MK six seven seven would cost like a dollar a day and comes in a ninety day supply. But my research animal actually took MK six seven seven and well before he took it he had joint issues with his knee, his hip, and both of his shoulders, which he had dislocated the left one five times, the right one three, and his right hip and his right knee from doing martial arts was jacked up so he started taking that and 16 months later he had no more issues in either of his shoulders his hip mm -hmm. hurts a little bit sometimes but nothing like it was and his knee has completely healed i'm sure that's coincidence though of course he was taking all three but the MK677 actually weaned him off of it by becoming more and more potent in his system until after 16 months he no longer needed to take it, which seemed that his pituitary was producing its own growth hormone in mass amounts and getting used to producing that much, it created a new homeostasis. So now he just figures he produces all he needs because he can, he no longer has a tolerance for MK677 except for in certain extreme cases like missing sleep and things like that so nonetheless the most important thing he can get to hydrate lubricate um put elasticity back in every cell and in the tendons is msm the next most important thing would be msm with ultra joint health giving the raw material to rebuild cartilage and cartilage is damaged um, and then MK677, which is not for human consumption, can only be used in research purposes and research facilities. Research chemicals are not for humans. They are, they could cause bodily harm and you just can't take them. Now, the other two products there are, have not been evaluated by the FDA, are not intended to diagnose, treat, prevent, cure, or cause any disease. They are simply supplements and all that we guarantee is what's on the label is in the bottle every single time so you get the raw materials your body does the healing as it's supposed to as god intended it to and the more and more we study the more we find out that god is way smarter than us every time we try to replicate what he does we screw it up so we decided to just start giving your body that materials that we know work that have been proven so that you can heal um so those would be the recommendations in a perfect world that you could use. You can buy them all at Noose Arms. Um, so I hope that helps. I mean, I know it'll help. But, well, no, I don't. I can't know it could help. That would be making a claim. I claim nothing but what's on the labels in the bottle. And this is purely comedy. Don't take anything I say as gospel. As a matter of fact, look up methyl sulfonyl methane and go to Google Scholar and look at all the studies, then look at the studies on the ingredients in Ultra Joint Health, and then look at the studies on MK677, and then make your decision mm -hmm. from there because only you are responsible for your health, even if they say that your doctor is a god of your body. In the end, he doesn't have the heart attack, nor the joint pains, nor the problems. You do. So make your decisions based on your knowledge, your information, and your integrity. And um, be sure that you buy from someone who has integrity enough to put his name and phone number on a video so that you can contact him. So anyway, appreciate you. And uh, any way that we can help further, that's what I'm here for.